Hey everybody, Brick Lover 18 here today with an October 2015 Lego City update. The city looks way different. And if you have no idea why, I suggest you check the cards right now for the mid-month September Lego City update that I did. As you can see, I really changed the look of the Lego City. The main thing that I have done was moved all the buildings to the very back wall and now I have room for this park area. Right now I have this museum, you know, just kind of set here, but I don't know where I'm going to put that in the future. Right now I have the very front doors of the park, which are kind of closed, and then I have this gate going all the way along. I was going to do this fencing, but unfortunately I don't have enough fence pieces at this time, so I just decided to do half and half. Over here, this part of the beach, or the park, I did add this beach because what it's going to do, it's going to have like grass all around and it's going to look like a pond with just some artificial water just so there is some kids stuff to play. Artificial water and some sand and stuff like that. Like a man-made thing, not a natural. And that's why there's fencing, there's going to be flowers all the way along here. It's just kind of like a little pond where kids can swim. I'm still debating or not whether I'm going to leave this bike shop and cafe set right here, but I'm going to continue the fencing in the sidewalk and then have like a tree and a play area. I'll be the first to say the park doesn't look the best right now, but I promise you it'll look really good when it's done. Over here as you can see the buildings are all there, but the lighting has not yet been put back into each of the buildings because I did have to take them out to reconfigure the back here. Over here is the NCIS building. As you can see, I've moved the fountain over just to center it in front of the building more, and I'm continuing the sidewalk there to another 48 by 48 base plate, where I'm going to have like the miniature mall mock and then the huge tower mock. Part of the tower is over here right now because I actually dropped a lot of it, and it's all in that bin there. Over there in this like the center right there sort of thing, I'm going to make a really cool ball mock with the ball and the date and stuff's going to be like there, kind of like Times Square. And it's not just going to be the standard stuff thing, I'm going to have it look really cool. Right here in the city is something extremely awesome that I can't wait for you to see, but unfortunately I can't show you yet until I make a video of it on my channel. But it is going to be very, very awesome, and it's something that a lot of cities don't have. You can try and guess what it is down in the comments below, but even if you get it, I'm not going to tell you. Over here I have the police station, it's the same police station, nothing has changed. And then right beside it I've added the hospital mock slash modified set. In the middle of the street here I'm gonna put this base plate with the Avengers Tower mock there. I think that's gonna look pretty neat once I do some renovations to it just sitting in the center there so cars can go around it because basically the whole city is one lane. Once I stop putting things in the city the train tracks still gonna continue along the whole length here. And as you can see the train station is right behind all these modular buildings. I'm just going to fix it up when it's time to actually fix it up. The city doesn't look like much right now, but I promise you by the mid-month update, because I will be doing one, there's going to be a lot of changes and it's going to start to look like a city again. You'll also have to let me know down in the comments below what you think of the city museum and where should I put it to kind of integrate it into the park area. Thanks so much everybody for watching this October LEGO City update. I promise you there'll be a mid-month city update in mid-October, probably around the 15th or something like that, just to show you a little bit of the progress that I have made so far. Hopefully by that time I'll have the lights back added to the building so it can light up again. Don't forget to let me know down below what you think of the city. Thanks so much for watching this Brick Lover 18 LEGO video. If you enjoyed this video and you want to subscribe for all LEGO all the time, click the subscribe brick and you'll subscribe to our channel. If you want to see more of our previously uploaded LEGO YouTube videos, check the cards as there's a playlist there containing all our videos. If you want to see more Brick Lover 18, head on over to BrickLover18.com where you'll find the links to our Twitter and our Instagram and our Brick Club. Before you go, don't forget to leave a like on this video as well as a comment. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already by clicking the subscribe brick. Thanks everybody for watching and I hope you have a great day.